and you roll your sleeves up and give it all. And then you leave it on the floor. Oscar winner Louis Gosset Jr., known for his unforgettable performances in An Officer and a Gentleman and Jaws 3, has sadly passed away at the age of 87. His daughter confirmed his passing on Thursday night in Santa Monica, California. While the cause of death has not been disclosed, Gosset had previously announced in 2010 that he was diagnosed with prostate cancer. Gosset's career spanned several decades, with notable appearances in films like The Color Purple and the groundbreaking miniseries Roots. In a surprising revelation, he shared that he gave up a potential professional basketball career with the New York Knicks to pursue his passion for acting in Hollywood. His journey into the world of acting began in high school when he landed his first acting credit in the school production of You Can't Take It With You. Despite being sidelined from the basketball team due to an injury, Gossett found his true calling on stage. Known for his athletic build and commanding presence, Gossett Jr. delivered powerful performances in demanding roles. His portrayal of Drill Sergeant Emile Foley in An Officer and a Gentleman earned him an Oscar in 1982 and solidified his status as a Hollywood icon. He even brought the Drill Sergeant persona to other films like The Punisher and The Iron Eagle franchise. Gossett's impact extended beyond the big screen. In 1977, he made a breakthrough on television as Fiddler in the groundbreaking miniseries Roots, which shed light on the horrors of slavery. His performance earned him an Emmy and captivated an audience of over 100 million viewers. Reflecting on his role in Roots, Gossett once said, all the top African-American actors were asked and I begged to be in there. I got the best role, I think. It was wonderful. While his final on-screen appearance was in the 2023 Oscar-nominated film, The Color Purple, Gossett had 12 upcoming projects in the works at the time of his passing, including the highly anticipated animation If, featuring Ryan Reynolds. Gossett's acting career took off after his first performance in high school. Encouraged by an English teacher, he auditioned for the production of Take a Giant Step in Manhattan and landed the part. At just 16 years old, he made his Broadway debut in 1953. Before his Hollywood success, Gossett crossed paths with legendary figures like James Dean, Marilyn Monroe, Martin Landau, and Steve McQueen. He studied acting with them at an offshoot of the actor's studio taught by Frank Silvera. Throughout his career, Gossett faced discrimination and racism, which fueled his commitment to fighting against it. He founded the Ericism Foundation, an organization dedicated to combating racism. Gossett's legacy will forever be remembered, not only for his remarkable talent, but also for his resilience in the face of adversity. He overcame personal struggles with addiction and health issues, including toxic mold syndrome and prostate cancer. In 1983, Gossett became the third black actor to be nominated for an Oscar in the supporting actor category. He won the award for his unforgettable portrayal of a Marine drill instructor in An Officer and a Gentleman. This achievement solidified his position as a trailblazing black actor in Hollywood. Despite his success, Gossett remained humble and focused on his craft. He once said, more than anything, it was a huge affirmation of my position as a black actor. The Oscar gave me the ability to choose good parts in movies like Enemy Mine, Sadat, and Iron Eagle. Gossett's impact on the entertainment industry is immeasurable. His talent, dedication, and unwavering spirit will continue to inspire generations of actors and audiences alike.